bad boy is going to sell pretty quick, I think. Oh, it is. So what are you thinking, Shane? Should we put this uh, inside in the show and let well, Brian polish on it? That's what I was thinking. I mean, this is one of the nicest 69 C10s I've ever seen. This thing is frame off, brand new, 350, full speed, perfect paint job, flawless, absolutely gorgeous truck. So I think this one might need to go in the show. Yeah, this is a pretty truck, man. Basically brand new. Chain. And we got it here. The grab and snatch has arrived. Let's show them the LS and then uh, let let's them hear it. Let's check out this engine in this car. This truck. That's gorgeous. I think people want to hear it run, Shane. Rev it up a little, little bit. Quick. Okay, let's fire this thing. I love how they did the exhaust on the pipes over here. I've ever 
quality of this truck. The frame off. Basically, looks like a brand new truck chain. Even the interior is really nice. Beautiful truck. I have a feeling someone's gonna end up leaving with this at this show. I think somebody's gonna be real happy when they drive this truck. Home. I think so. This truck is going to be gone after this show, and this truck is going to be gone after that show. I think it's bad. Look at this interior. The interior work on here alone is. Trying to trade your Camaro for this, Ron? Uh, trying to trade your Camaro for this? Uh, if the guy's got any money to go with the trade. Alright, that makes sense. Is this yours? No, it ain't mine. Boy, it's beautiful. Oh, he's a He is 68, I think. That's probably his. Yeah, this is this is a pretty nice one. If you're gonna do trade, this is the one I'd say trade on. Hey, that car will bring that car is gonna bring some money. I say money. that is what you pick, man. I think this is what's the red Chevelle. Well, right over here. It's not a true red It doesn't have to be. It doesn't have to be. Different than what we had a mark. I bet you he marks it up. Yeah, but I 
I wouldn't even, I wouldn't try to even pick him up. I don't like the sound of the motor either, Dan. Yeah. Okay. I don't like the sound of the motor. Got this 1955 Bel Air hardtop. Wow, this car is over the top. LS3, all detailed out under the hood. Let's look at the craftsmanship. Check out the interior. Beautiful leather. Super, super sweet car. Paint job's gorgeous. Shot wheels with red lines. Finished out in the trunk. This is an absolute amazing car right here. A lot of detail. That's what we look at. And we got a gorgeous 1967 convertible Camaro custom interior. Really like the way they done all the lines and the seats. Love the console all the way to the back of the seat. Beautiful slick car. Gorgeous, gorgeous fuel injected small block with a AC. Very tastefully done. Beautiful car. Check out this gorgeous split window right here. Late model Holly fuel injection. It looks like the old fuel injection. Custom interior. Shot wheels. Oh, we got a couple of the split windows. We're a big fan of the split windows, that's for sure. Very tastefully done. All right, so what's your favorite car so far, Shane? Uh, my favorite car so far is probably the gray 55 Bel Air. That's just a gorgeous car. Very well put together. A lot of craftsmanship in that car. You can just really tell the detail in that car. So it's really probably one of my favorite cars in the show so far. That was pretty nice. I've seen a few cars out on the strip I like as well. Oh, yeah, there's we'll a few. more of those in the video. Yes, we will. Oh yeah. Not a big Mustang. No, definitely not. But this is a lot of work in this car. It's absolutely gorgeous. Beautiful interior. Very tastefully done. Hey, your dad came by earlier. Did you talk to him? Yeah, super good guy. Yeah, yeah I told him. I told him to come see you. He told me he needs some wide whites for his car. Or yeah, truck. That's what he said. Show me the cars y'all got. You got some beautiful cars. You got some pretty cool stuff. And I told him to come on by and um, or just give me a call. Okay, you got just them with you. Tell me your same's dad. Tell have me you, your same dad. I'll take care of you. What I told have him. you? Uh, you got you got the wide whites with you? Um, I had a set of two twenty fives, but he said he's like, grab and snatch. All right, we're gonna we're gonna relocate the grab and snatch to see if we can catch a little more attention on this thing. Yeah, so this is kind of a tough little spot because you got all these uh, trees over here. And it's kind of blocked from the main road. To so move it over here next to this 454 SS. Cart. The trip is only so much better when the golf cart arrives.
Normally we have it with us in the beginning, but we were just full. He's gonna be going up here. These ramps are a little sad, you know. But they lie. Turn them upside down and build them back. I'm happy about the golf cart back. We have the golf cart. So much better. It's going to make it so much nicer for shopping for cars. Yes. Uh, looking for some of these sexy, gorgeous, beautiful street rods and muscle cars. Stay with us. We have Shane over here putting the step plate back on the golf cart. Had to take it off when uh, we loaded up Jim's trailer and uh, be able to squeeze it on there. We're trying to get it back over here. And then we're going to cruise around, take a look at cars. And I tell you, it's a lot better experience on a golf cart. Much better. Way better. Stick around. Sunsets here are nice. Sometimes no it works. works. I didn't see a sign. 